The CDC says children are less likely to get really sick. But they also say this vaccine reduces their risk of hospitalization and COVID symptoms. News Channel 8's Justin Checker live outside of Publix in Tampa tonight. Justin, we hear the vaccines are on the way. And they should arrive in the coming days. Keith and Jen, good evening to you both. Publix and other pharmacies across Tampa Bay are already taking appointments while local pediatricians are preparing to vaccinate their patients in this younger age group. Rupa Friedhoff says her seven-year-old daughter is ready to roll up her sleeve for the COVID-19 vaccine. It is truly a sense of relief to, to be able to say she's going to be able to get the vaccine. She's going to be like 90-something percent protected. As soon as the CDC authorized the distribution of Pfizer doses for children ages 5 to 11, Friedhoff says she scheduled multiple appointments. She wants to make sure her daughter gets her first shot by early next week. I'm very data driven and, and that's why I'm making this choice and I, I really do hope that other parents are listening and making that same choice for their children. Many parents are taking a wait and see approach. I don't want to give my kids a vaccine unnecessarily if their body can fight it off naturally. But at Small World Pediatrics in Pasco County, Dr. Nancy Silva says the wait list for shots has been building the past month. I mean, we already have at least 50 people that want it like now. Dr. Silva says she hopes her staff will start to administer shots by next Monday at the latest after the federal government shipment arrives Friday at the Florida Department of Health. They either ship it or you arrange a pickup. So we opted for a pickup so we could start sooner than later. And the doctor says she is eager for her own seven-year-old daughter to get vaccinated for both the medical and social benefits. I want her to also go back to having fun with her friends. I don't want it to just be Zoom. I don't want it to be just be masked or only be outdoors. I want her to have all the things that she could have and not have the same worries. And both moms tell me they believe it's important for children to get vaccinated to curb the spread of this virus. The CDC says the COVID vaccines will continue to undergo rigorous safety monitoring. Now, the most common side effect in Pfizer's clinical trial ages 5 to 11 was a sore arm. We're live tonight in Tampa. I'm Justin Shecker, 8 on your side.